Hello everybody, this is Michael Gatewood and I wanted to talk with you a little bit about uh, a little retouching on skin. There's been an old mindset that you use the clone stamp for most any imperfection that you would have on the face or arm or whatever. But with the new tools of Photoshop CC and 2014, not only have they given us great new tools, but they've really made huge improvements on the spot healing brush, the healing brush, the patch tool. But without a doubt, my go-to tool right now is the spot healing brush. I've got the spot healing brush right now, and really, there's no sampling, there's no holding down the L key, and sampling good skin and putting it over bad. It's just simply going over the bad and watching it whisk away. So any imperfections, any moles, any spots on the face that need to go away, it's real easy to get through the job real quick and fix any imperfections. If you see something on the face, if you see a razor burn or anything that you need to get rid of, I'm talking quick, easy fixes. The Spot Healing Brush, without a doubt, one of the best tools for dealing with imperfections on the skin, any blemishes or any other problems. Let me kind of zoom in here a little bit, let you get into the tool so you can see it. That is the Spot Healing Brush. Now when you're using it, also just remember that you've got, and let me get right back in the Photoshop, you've got all kinds of options. You can also go with blend modes and a proximity match or uh, create texture. But one of the options that I'm choosing, especially in CC 2014, is content aware. And that basically means it looks at the area, it takes the surrounding area, and fills in. One other option might be also to sample all layers. So any of the imperfections you're getting rid of would happen on a separate layer. So if you have this checked, you'll have the ability to sample from a layer below and put that fix on the layer above the image. This is a fantastic tool, the Spot Healing Brush. My name is Michael Gatewood. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, everybody.